Shalom, Shalom. Shalom. Hey, we the real Hebrew Israelites coming to you again with another sit down. And first and foremost, we want to give all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh, 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 Double honors to the elders and apostles of Great Millstone who rule well. Peace and salutations to all the Octan pushing out this word with truth, sincerity, and charity, man. Hey, just want to say, man, it's a uh, man. This is something to delight in, man. This truth. You know, the elder, Uriah, in Chicago, he always say, man, you know, this is a glimpse of the kingdom. You know, being around brothers, you know, uh, man, you know, the brothers with that same like mind. Brothers that's pushing the same thing you pushing, worshiping the name of Yahweh Bashem Yahweh More so following the law, statutes, and commandments to the best of their ability. And, man, just just doing what we got to do as men to get up out of this place, you know. And, uh, you know, real quick, I'm going to just share it. You know, these Jehovah's Witnesses came to my mama crib yesterday. And they knocked on the door early in the morning. And they asked me, like, yeah, they like, do you know the, uh, they like, do you know what God made the, the Bible for or something? <laughs> and I was like, like, I was sleepy. Like, I still had sleep in my eyes. They, they kept ringing the doorbell. I'm like, man, to follow the law, that's just the commandments of the Bible, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, I'm like, yeah, we got to follow the law, that's the commandments. So, you know, we got a couple of precepts. We just going to hop right into it. You know? So, why, bro? Can I bring this out real quick? Bible question, bro. It's because uh, he said the fall of the law starts the commandments, man. And, 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 and these Christians is hypocrites, man. <laughs> and they so-called say uh, this and that and this and that. But, hey, um, <coughs> hey, they don't follow the law starts the commandments to the best ability, man. They still eat pork. <laughs> yeah. Hey, and once the, uh, the Lord said the... Uh, that the law uh, uh, abide forever, man. It's Baruch 4 and 1. It say, this is the book of the commandment of Yahweh and the law that endure forever. So regardless of the fact where you at, all generations, man, you for the follow it, your seeds for the follow it, everything, right? All that have keep it shall come to life, but such that leave it shall die. So all them Jehovah Witnesses, all them uh, Christians, all them people that uh, say uh, the law done away with, they going to perish, man. Because this is a, a serious thing, man. The law is supposed to, uh, what uh, the law is not made for a, a righteous, man. It's made for a sinner. That's right. First Timothy tell you that, man. Yep, and uh, this is the book of Psalms, chapter 1, verse 2, says, But his delight is in the law of the Lord. Mm. So his delight is the, is, the, is the law of the Lord, man. What you need to be doing, what uh make him happy, is to buy in the law. Mm. And we know that uh, we in this flesh, we can't keep the law 100%, but at least try. And when you read Judges, you say what? Hey, rehearse, rehearse the uh, righteous acts, man. So we supposed to at least try. Keep going. It says, <clears throat> but his delight is in the law of Yahweh, and his law doth he, and in his law doth he meditate day and night. Mm -hmm. And he shall be like a tree planted by the rivers of water, mm -hmm. that bringeth forth his fruits in in his season. His leaf also shall not wither. And whatsoever he do it shall prosper. Shall so prosper, man. Because what? When you read uh, John, uh, uh, I believe uh, 8, one year, uh, out of the valley, says for rivers living water, man. Mm -hmm. Hey, we supposed to uh, uh, bow in, the, in, this, in this truth. That's how we increase. Because water uh, constantly flow. They increase. Unless it, uh, it stopped up by a dam. Then the water gets shut off. But we supposed to increase. We supposed to be growing. We supposed to be them living waters, man. This is the book of John, chapter 7, verse 38. Seven. He that believeth on me, as the scriptures have said. How the scriptures I said. And that's what a lot of people don't do. They don't believe in the scriptures. Mm -mm. I guess what? Because Hebrews and Psalms say what? Uh, I uh, come in the value of the book. Right. So it's the whole book. The whole law. <laughs> right? Keep going. Out of his belly shall flow rivers of living water. And out of his belly shall live, uh, flow rivers of water, man. That's the life. That's the way. Because you have a shot say what? I'm the way. I'm the door. No one has come, by, uh, come in uh, uh, but by through me. Mm -hmm. So that's the way we're supposed to be living. 
Anything y'all got, got some fucking bones. This is the book of Joshua, chapter 1, verse 8. I was just thinking that. Come on. I'm going to start at 7. Only be thou strong and very courageous that thou mayest observe to do according to all the law. Mm -hmm. right. Which Moses, my servant, commanded thee. Which Moses, my servant. Mm -hmm. So guess what? I just let you know that, because uh, guess what? Yahweh Shah was quoting Moses. Even in the New Testament. Yeah. We're supposed to keep the old laws. Mm -hmm. All those Old Testaments that don't believe in, in the New Testament. All the prophets was doing was quoting the old. The old and new go hand in hand, man. Come in the volume of the whole book, man. Okay. You know, that the whole road, you know. You got some more on that book. Keep going, it says, turn not from it to the right hand or to the left, that thou mayest prosper whatsoever thou goest. Hmm. This, and we, hey, yeah, go on here, bro. We, 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 continue, we discontinue from our heritage. Which yeah, is that's this, right. With this uh, book, man. Uh, uh, law, statute, commandments. And that's why we ain't prosper as a nation, as a whole. You know, but now the Lord commanded us to come back so that we can prosper, that we will prosper. It says, verse 8, This book of the law shall not depart of thy mouth, but thou shalt meditate therein day Ooh. and night, Ooh. that thou mayest observe to do according to all that is written therein. For then thou shalt make thy way prosperous. So like it, it say all. That's right, all. It say some. All. It say little. All. It say all, man. So what are all these people you would take? Uh, I, I, I'll eat pork, but I don't do the other. No, you're not supposed to do that or this. Everything. Mm -hmm. It's a cut to all you. Man. Cut session. So they keep going. Yep, that's right. For then thou shalt make thy way prosperous, and then thou shalt have good success. Ooh, ooh that's a cut. Mm. Good success, man. So all these people say, uh, I'm success and this and that. No, you're not. You're not really blessed. Nope. You're wicked. Like the scriptures just say, man. Because guess what? The Lord controlled the wicked side, man. He blessed them to a certain extent. Yep. But guess what? They're not blessing this word. Mm -mm. They're not rich in knowledge. They're not rich in your house by Shema Rashi. So guess what? They're going to die. That's right. Hey, since you mentioned that, I got it right here for you. This is the book of Malachi. Chapter 3, mm -hmm. uh, verse 12. And all nations shall call you blessed. Mm. For ye shall be the lightsome land, saith Yahweh of hosts. Your words have bind stout against me, saith Yahweh. Yet ye say, what have we spoken so much against thee? Ye have said it is a vain, it is vain to serve God. And what profit is it that we have kept his ordinance? Or that we shall walk mournfully before the Lord of hosts. And now we call the proud happy. Yeah, they that work wickedness are set up. Yeah, they that tempt God are even delivered. Going into what the brother was saying. Uh, the scripture says in Psalms 37. They uh, fret not thyself no. because of the evil man that prosper in his way. You know, roughly paraphrase it. But guess what? Job 5, I tell you, the triumph of the wicked is what for a moment. I mean, Job the 20th chapter. So we understand, knowing that, like the brother said, a lot of people, they pick and choose. They think they have success in carnal and temporary things. But if you don't have the success in the scriptures, man, you did. Yeah, you hey, naked. Hey, what Moses said, man. Hey, when you read Deuteronomy the sixth chapter, it said, this is the law and the commandments and mm -hmm. statutes to walk inside of the nations. That would make us blessed. Mm -hmm. To live by the law. Yep. And like I said, hey, we can't keep the law because we're in this flesh. We go off. But we still supposed to uh, try to the best of our ability through faith. Because the Lord have given us grace mm. to, 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 to come back into his good graces, man. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, I just wanted to back up, mind you, you know. <clears throat> and uh, this is just back in the Ecclesiastes 10 and uh, this 27. It says, uh, no, I'm going to just start at verse 26. I'm going to make a point. It says, Be not overwise in doing thy business, and boast not in thyself in the time of thy distress. Better is he that laboreth and aboundeth in all things. So let's go right to what I was saying. You know, all things, man. You know, the whole, the, the, all of the scriptures, man. This law, statutes, and commandments that must be abided by, hey, hey, in order to receive that, 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 that grace, man. 
you know, not just picking and choosing which commandments you want to follow. Just because in the commandments you don't see, thou shalt not eat pork, don't mean that you're not supposed to eat it, man. But it do. Right. right. But it do. Right. It say, <laughs> it say don't, uh, it's an abomination to each one. Yep. Well, it touches dead carcasses. Yep. Man. Yes. It yep. gave you the dietary, the civil laws, the ceremony laws, man. Yeah, the Lord gave you the, the clean and unclean piece of the earth that you can eat, man. You know, but but y'all don't want to listen to it. Y'all don't y'all don't y'all don't care. It says, "Better is he that labored and abounded in all things than he that boasted him boasted himself and wanted bread." So you know, like I was saying about them dudes ringing the doorbell. That's why when they come across different camps and they just like they be fishing. They be wanting to know what you got to say. They want to know the scriptures that we got to say because they don't they don't know. And then they do know, man. They just don't want to. They don't want to uh, abide to what the Lord has told us to do, man. Uh -huh. They don't want to follow the laws, testaments, commandments. But in Psalms 119 and 1, it says, Blessed are the undefiled in the way, who walk in the law of the Lord. So who walk in the law of the Lord, man. Not just, oh, yeah, I know my Ten Commandments. I follow my Ten Commandments, you know. No, man, you got to walk in all the ways of, that the law, testaments, commandments, so like all, that the role has provided you, man. Not just some, not just the Old Testament, not just the New Testament. No, the whole book, man. Because yeah. some people say ten, just the Ten Commandments, but it's six hundred, I believe, six hundred and thirty-six uh, commandments, mm -hmm. laws. So uh, we supposed to keep all of them, man. Try to, because guess what? And the scriptures say, uh, even though uh, we we break one, hey, the scriptures say you break one, you can break them all. But through faith, hey, hey we able to keep those things, man. And that's why we're gonna be exempt. From uh from judgment, man. Cause the Lord uh uh, uh love when we uh, try, and even in the world uh when when you trying to do something, hey, what do the people do? They praise you. They be like, good 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 job. Mm -hmm. But when you not trying, hey, we don't care about you. That's mm -hmm. just like the Lord. It is Revelations three and ten. Because thou hast kept the word of my patience, I will also keep thee from the hour of temptation. We shall come upon all the world to try them that dwell upon the earth. And hey, this word is the whole book, like the brothers were going into. And if we keep it, the Lord's going to keep us in that terrible and great day that's coming upon uh, not just America, but the whole earth, man. That's right. You get the, um, the Cleese guys, you know, team that you want. No, oh, yeah, yeah. Because so, yeah. uh, I got a couple. Con, you want that back in 19? Yeah, Con, this is back in uh, Sirach chapter 10, verse 19. It says, They that fear Yahweh are a sure seed. And that's the key. Mm. You have to fear the Lord, man. And that's one of the commandments, man. Mm -hmm. All these people that out here walk proud, proudly, uh, arrogant. Hey, you're not humble. Mm. Keep going. It says, Really and it says, back in Sirach 10 and 19, says, They that fear you, how are our sure seed? So if you fear the Lord, you are sure seed. Keep hmm. going. And they that love him, an honorable plant. An honorable plant. Keep going. They that regard not the law uh -huh. are a dishonorable seed. So the ones that, uh, that, that put off the law, hmm. that eat pork, commit adultery, knowing they know it's wrong, man. Hey, you, 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 you're not a uh, sh for sure seed, man. Keep going. They that transgress the commandments are a deceivable seed. Uh huh. I think that was it. Hey, you, if you want to keep. No, nah, that's it. Yeah, that's it. Yeah. They are a deceivable seed, man. Mm -hmm. So back in this, uh, well, in this uh, Proverbs thirteen, verse thirteen, it say, "Whosoever despise the word shall be destroyed." Mm. But he that fear the commandment shall be rewarded. The law of the wise is a fountain of life to depart from the snares of death. So this is the way, this the uh, um, the way of life to get out of that jam to to come in the good graces of the Lord, man. And and these people know, man. You know why? Because Paul told them, man. It's Paul. I mean, it's Paul. It's Romans ten and one. Brethren, in my heart. Desire and pray to Yahweh for uh, for Israel that they might be saved. Because that's what we open it to be. To get saved out this hell right? Mm -hmm. Two, for I bear them record that they have a zeal of Yahweh, 
So they got a zeal mm -hmm. to want to wake up people and this and that, but they're not going about it the right way, man. But not according to knowledge. And what's knowledge? Keeping his laws. Lowering that uh, we fucked up, right? I'm going to jump down to uh, um, verse 9, because this is what we're supposed to be, man. Verse 8. But what say if the word is nigh thee, even in thy mouth and in thy heart, is that the word of faith which we preach, and that's what we do. We preach the, the kingdom of heaven at hand, that we are uh, of faith, yeah. of good graces of Yahweh by Shem Abishai, right? Verse 9, that if thou shalt confess with thy mouth the Lord Yahweh Shai, seeing that what? We fucked up, that we, uh, we go off, right? And, and shall believe in the heart that Yahweh have raised him from the dead, thou shalt be saved. So if we believe these things, that the Lord gave us good graces, and we confess, guess what? We shall be saved, right? For with the heart, man believe into righteousness. Mm -hmm. So with your mind, you're going to believe in righteousness. Because right. guess what? You're going to do it. You're going to mm -hmm. meditate, <laughs> right? Mm -hmm. And with the mouth, confession is made with salvation, man. Yeah. So that's Ooh. our salvation, man. That's right. Hey, by believing and walking it, man. Talk it like you walk it, man. That's right. Because Paul said what? You're not just a Jew alloy. You're a Jew enemy. We're supposed to keep these laws all the day long, man. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It says uh, in mm -hmm. Psalms, back in Psalms 119, verse 15, it says, I will meditate in thy precepts and have respect unto thy ways. I will delight myself in thy statutes. I will not forget thy word. It didn't say I will not forget. Some of the word. It's all of the word, man. And meditating our precepts and have respect unto the Lord's ways, man. Yahweh Shah being the head of man. We're supposed to follow the Yahweh Shah's footsteps, man. Not do what the heck we want to do, man. You know? So, so you people can't say that you love the Lord. You can't be knocking at people's doors early in the morning, waking them up, talking about you love the Lord. Hey, but the Lord tell you that, man. When you read Luke, it say don't go house to house. You're not supposed to do that, man. Hey, it's a way to teach the people, man. You know how you teach them? By going to the highways and byways, man. Put on uh, uh, videos on YouTube, land, man. That's the way, man. It's ways of going about certain things, man. But they don't read the Bible. They don't take these things uh, serious, man. Hey, you got something, boy? Uh, if not, I got this. Yeah, you bring that up. Hey, this First 1 Timothy 4. Uh, are you finished with that? So what? Come on, bro. Uh, uh, verse 12. Let no man despise thy youth, but be thy example of the brethren, I mean, believers in word and conversation and charity and, and spirit and faith and purity, man. And that's what we're supposed to do. Be an example to the flock, man. Showing them that, that charity, that brotherly love. Being in conversation and holiness, man. Don't the scripture say what? Keep your uh, conversation in, in the heavens, okay. right? Verse 4, uh, 13, till I come get attention to reading, we're supposed to be d dwelling in the law. Because the only way you're going to keep the law is if you know the law. It says to exhortation, to doctrine, neglect not the gift that is in thee, which was given thee by uh, prophecy, which the land of the hands of the prophetary, man. Meaning the elders, right? Meditate upon these things. What things, man? Mm. Meaning the law. Give thyself holy to them, that that prophet might be able to appear to all. Okay. Right? It say, take heed into thyself and to doctrine, continuing them, for doing it, thou shalt both say thyself and them that hear thee. Because why? They're going to see that you doing it, you walking, and you uh, keeping the law. And guess what? They're going to walk and keep the law as well, man. And it says, that's how, it says, shall save thee. So that's how you get salvation, and that's how you, man, wake up the most high's flock, man. That's how that's how we receive salvation, man. That's right, brother. I got one for you, brothers. It is the book of Deuteronomy 6 and 4. Yep. Hear, O Israel, Yahweh our God is one Lord. Mm -hmm. And thou shalt love Yahweh thy God with all thy heart and with all thy soul and with all thy might. And these words which I commanded thee this day, Shall be in thy heart, and that's meditating, because heart goes back to your mind, man. Wow. Yep. It says, "Thou shalt teach them diligently unto thy children, and shalt talk of them when thou sittest in thy house, uh -huh. and when thou walkest by the way, 
And when thou liest down and when thou rises up, and that's meditation, man. So whatever you do in your day to in your in day to day life, scripture should be coming out. Wisdom should meet you in every thought, as it says in the uh, Wisdom of Solomon, I believe. Hey, and th that's what the Lord commanded us. And it says, And thou shalt bind them from a sign upon thy hand, and, and thou shalt uh, they shall be frontlets between thy eyes, man. Mm. Yeah, and this was literal, but you know, all things are spiritual for us literal. You know, and that's what we're doing today, man. This is frontless to our eyes, man. The scripture says, Anoint thyself for outside, that thou mayest see. That's right. In the book of Revelations, man. That's right. And what's, uh, what chapter? Deuteronomy 6, four, 4 through 8. Come, you got anything else? Mm -mm. I want to close up. Hey, man, we, we hope this lesson was edifying. We want to give all praise on and glory too. Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shad, Ba'ashem, Rakak Kadash. Double honors to the elders and apostles of Great Millstone again, who rule well. Peace and salutations to all you all can pushing out this word with truth, sincerity, and charity. Keep fighting, Arkham, to the most highs elect. We would like to say Shalom. Shalom. And the Baba 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 Baba.